How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. As you know, Series 7 has recently been announced and within the Series 7 stream we got a sneak peek at Series 8 and that's what we're going to be covering very quickly in today's video. What is coming to Series 8? We actually know a lot of the cars already. If you like to hear about Forza news guys and enjoy videos like this, please do consider subscribing because I cover everything you need to know. Let's get into the video. Series 8 will start on the 26th of May, which is four weeks and one day from now because Series 7 starts tomorrow and lasts four weeks. And on the new festival playlist for Series 7, if we go to the final coming soon tab that tells us all about Series 8, we can see that the theme for Series 8 is German Automotive Excellence. So in Series 8 we are getting new events, as you can see. We are getting the Porsche 911 GT3 from 2021, the 992 version. We are getting the Mercedes-Benz AMG GT and the Audi RS4 Avant from 2018. Now in the live stream from a few days ago about Series 7, Mike Brown explained why they had to do this. They sort of have to sometimes merge updates together and include two updates worth of content within one update, does that make sense? We don't have access to any of the Series 8 stuff yet, but they had to put it in the game, so they may as well announce it rather than us figure out stuff ourselves. This is what he said on the live stream about it. <laughs> uh, there was a clue there that pointed towards the German flag, and that's because the theme for Series 8 is uh, German automotive excellence. Um, uh, you can see some cars on the screen there. We're not going to go into any further detail there, but they will be included as part of Series 8. Uh, the reason we're kind of revealing them now is because they're actually included in this update. Um, sometimes we just include future content in an update just because it allows us to more efficiently get updates out to you on time. So we'll talk about this more um, in Series 8. In now because of this, we can actually go into the game and figure out what all of the other stuff coming in this Series 8 update are. For example, if you go to your car pass and scroll all the way to the end, you'll see that not only do we have the new four Series 7 car pass vehicles, we have Series 8 car pass vehicles as well. Coming on the 26th of May, the first week of Series 8, we'll have the BMW M8 Competition Coupe from 2020. On the 2nd of June, we will have the Audi RS3 sedan from 2020. On the 9th of June, we will have the Audi RS5 Coupe from 2018. And then on the 16th of June, we will have the Volkswagen pickup LX 1982. This of course means that after that, on the 23rd of June, that's when these Series 9 car pass vehicles will start, which obviously we have no idea what those are going to be yet. That's a good two months away. So, so far with Series 8, we already know of seven of the new vehicles coming, all of which are German cars, as expected. And now we know the car pass vehicles, we can narrow down that the three vehicles shown on the Festival Players Coming Soon tab these three vehicles will be part of the festival playlist. Now there's only three, usually there's one per week, so there's a very good chance that we are, you know, missing maybe one or two cars coming in the update as well. Now something very interesting about all of the cars that are coming is almost all of them have been on the leaked car list. The Audis and the BMW M8 are all vehicles we knew were in the game files and were potentially coming in series 8, 9 or 10, whenever. If we want to make any educated guesses about what other potential series 8 cars we might be getting, if there are any, we just need to look for German cars on this list. Quite a lot of the recent leaks that were German cars are being added, so what are some other ones you can pick out? Let me know in the comment section below and make your guesses. Now we can assume within Series 8 there will be a bunch of features and you know little fixes and stuff like that. These aren't things that we're going to know anytime soon until Torben Tuesday in about three weeks. Over on GT Planet, a very known person over there called the Admeister, he took a deep dive into the new cars that are coming and managed to find some unique things about these Series 8 vehicles. I'm not going to read them all out, you can see what they are on screen right now, but the main ones are the Audi RS4 and the BMW M8 coming in Series 8 are going to have body kits with them. For example, as you can see, the RS4 is going to have the ABT RS4-R Aero Kit, I'll have a picture on screen of what I presume this is going to be like from looking at the kit on Google. And the BMW M8 has the 850i's AC, I don't know how to pronounce that word, I'm going to skip so you can't take the mick out of me. But yet again, that's another aero kit the BMW M8 will have in Series 8. Again, a picture on screen of what I presume this is going to look like. If it interests you, you can read all of the other things that all of the new Series 7 and Series 8 vehicles are going to have upgrade-wise. You know, the more unique stuff that stand out. There's quite a few on there and I thought I'd like to show you all. Now, something else quite interesting which I want to mention in this video is the car pass. We all know every month with the car pass we get 
get four new vehicles, one every week. Now, I personally forgot about this, but a few people have actually sort of remembered this, but the car pass actually only gives us 42 extra cars. If you go to the whole description when you're going to buy the car pass, it says get 42 extra cars at one low price. The car pass will deliver 34 new cars to your game weekly, one per week, and as a bonus you'll receive eight Formula Drift cars. Now if you go to the car pass and count all of the cars that we've been given within the car pass so far, you'll count 39 of them. That's including the Series 7 and Series 8 vehicles, which means on the third week of Series 9, somewhere in June, July time, the car pass will be no longer. They will have fulfilled the car pass and there'll be no more car pass vehicles coming. Which is bringing the idea of maybe around that time is when they're going to, you know, give us a bit of information on the first expansion coming out. It is rumoured to be in the June, July time anyway. I know the rumours sort of keep pushing it back. But June, July, August time for the first expansion seems very likely, in my opinion. You may remember in the last Torben Tuesday, there was a slight hint towards something being delayed from June to July with this little clue right here. And the car pass just happens to end three weeks into Series 9, around the June, July time. It's just, just an interesting thought to think about. Maybe, maybe when the car pass comes to an end, that's when we'll hear a bit more solid information about the, uh, the first expansion. I certainly hope so anyway. As of now, that's everything we know about Series 8. We will know more if there is a Torben Tuesday in three weeks, which is one week before Series 8 begins. I'm looking forward to that. Leave a like if you've enjoyed, everyone. Subscribe if you haven't already for more content just like this. And I'll see you all later.